Hi, kids. Buongiorno, buongiorno, buongiorno. You know what buongiorno means? Bon means good. Giorno means morning. It means good morning in Italian. Hey, why are we speaking a little Italian? Because this is the Discover the Da Vinci New Radio Program, and Leonardo da Vinci was from Florence, Italy. My name is Mark Rogers, and I'm the director of the Da Vinci Machines and Michelangelo's Exhibitions for North America. But you know what that really means? It means I get to hang around Leonardo da Vinci's inventions every day. But you know what we're going to do every day when we get together? We are going to dream and think and imagine and create and wonder just like Leonardo da Vinci did every day of his life. And we're going to talk about the things that he thought about and he talked about. But you know what we're also going to do? We're going to talk about what you're thinking about. Because just like Leonardo da Vinci did, he had all these incredible ideas. Can you imagine he had 2,500 of his designs, inventions, and theories we use every day of our modern day life? But you know what? I've got ideas too. And I write down those ideas just like da Vinci did. And that's the one thing I want to tell you about what Leo did. Every day of his life, he had a pencil and a piece of paper with him and a notebook. Whenever he had an idea, he'd write them down, whether they were good or bad. So he wouldn't forget them. Do you ever have a great idea? I do all the time. I think, oh man, I could do this or I can do that. Or they should do this or they should do that. Or wouldn't it be great if they had this that could do that? And then I think about it and I said, you know, this idea is so good. I'm always going to remember it. But then when I get home, I forgot them. Can you believe it? So what I want to tell you to do just what da Vinci did. He wrote down every one of his ideas so he could think about them later and he could bring them to their full fruition and their full potential and have a little bit more time to go in depth of them to make them really cool. So that's what I want to tell you to do. Always have a pencil, a piece of paper, a notebook is really the best, and write down your ideas. Hey, I got another question for you. You were probably pretty good at the Bond Journal one because that means good morning. But what is, put on your thinking caps now, what is the most famous painting in the history of the world? Well, you know what it is? It's the Mona Lisa. <laughs> well, everyone says it is the most famous painting in the history of the world. It's the most visited painting in the history of the world as over in France at the Louvre Museum. Well, I have another question for you. Do you know what the second most famous painting in the history of the world is? Yeah. Well, they say it's the Last Supper. Guess who painted the Last Supper? Leonardo da Vinci. Leonardo da Vinci painted probably the two of the most famous paintings in the history of the world. But you know what he also did? He had over 44,000 inventions that he wrote down, but actually only 14,000 of them survived till today. And they say we use every one of his inventions and his designs and his theories every day of our life. So get ready. You know what's going to happen every time we get together. I promise you, this is going to be the best five minutes of your day. Because we're going to find out how da Vinci ran his life. And we're going to discover how all the great geniuses in this world ran their lives. And we're going to try to figure out how we can use their genius and our own imagination to make our life better for us every day. We are going to dream and together we are going to think and imagine and create and wonder. And we are going to help each other discover the Da Vinci in you. I promise. So write down your ideas because I want you to get ready for the next time we get together. We are not going to talk about inventions. Da Vinci was so creative. Everybody wanted to be associated with, with Da Vinci. Da Vinci designed musical instruments. Da Vinci designed, where do you hear this? The original drum machine. Can you imagine? He planned parties, designed clothing, designed handbags. We are going to cover the gamut of not only Da Vinci, but all the great geniuses. And we're going to apply them to our lives today. Once again, this is Mark Rogers from Da Vinci and Michelangelo, the Titans Experience. We are going to get together and dream and think, imagine and create and wonder. Next time on Discover Da Vinci and You, we're going to talk about the tank, the submarine, the helicopter, the glider. And you know, 550 years ago, Da Vinci designed the original robot. We're going to talk about that too and, and the great gift that he gave to the King of France. So once again, great to talk to you. Ciao, baby. Ciao.